All right, welcome to another exciting episode of The Insurance Zone with Dennis McCurdy and Justin Bellinger, brought to you by The McCurdy Group. So recently, we've been receiving a lot of calls at the agency in regards to uh, increases to auto, auto premiums, and uh, today we're going to talk about a few of those reasons. Uh, one is higher repair and replacement costs. Uh, one of our employees was actually involved in an accident uh, last month, and uh, she went to go get a rental car, had a limit of $30 a day, really? and realized that that is not enough. That's not enough right now, so... Uh, we're recommending to most of our clients that they increase their, their substitute transportation uh, limit because it's a lot more expensive to uh, rent the vehicles right now. Right. Even though, I mean, cars are not even available at some places, right. so it's really important to have a good, adequate amount. So it comes first, comes first serve. And if you've got the money and the insurance, the, the uh, rental companies are going to certainly give you a second. They're most, more likely to rent to you. Be prepared. Also, accidents are more severe. Um, riskier driving behavior seems like since COVID, everybody's uh, <laughs> been driving a little bit quicker, more aggressive, and that's certainly uh, uh, adding to uh, more severe accidents, which is increasing the overall loss for the for the carriers. Absolutely, and like the old commercial used to say too, for uh, it was uh, one of the chicken commercials used to say, "Parts is parts." Remember that commercial? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, well, you're too young to remember, but parts are parts. And to get parts these days for the auto repair business, it's really crazy. They're having a hard time getting labor, yep. having a hard time getting hard time getting the parts, never mind fixing your car. All of these things extend the amount of time your car is down. It extends the cost of repairing your car. It's become really a serious issue. I right? recently saw an article that said that the average claim duration lasted about 21, 22 days. That's up to 28 to about 31 right, right. now. So so time of having the rental vehicle is, is greater. Uh, like you said, to, to get those parts, sometimes the parts aren't available. It's right. impacted because of the, the pandemic. And of course, everything's more expensive, including medical bills. Uh, you get into a to an accident, and the medical bills add up. So, and just because you're accident free doesn't mean that your rates aren't going to go up. Right, because re insurance is a sharing mechanism. Everyone's rates go up when there are accidents. The more accidents, the more everyone ra everyone's rate goes up. One thing people don't always understand is the rates in your community are based on all the drivers in your community. So if you have an accident in Boston, but you live in Sturbridge, Massachusetts, the Sturbridge, Massachusetts rates are affected, not the Boston rates. But as Justin said, the, the medical costs are gone through the roof. They're just, everything is just so expensive. And so that's something to be really aware of. I mean, look at your health insurance premiums at work. If you, if you have health insurance at work, you'll see that the premiums beco are becoming astronomical. I've seen some family plans up to three thousand dollars a month. Mm. It's it's absolutely crazy. So, I, like I always tell people, the good news is we're living longer. The bad news is the cost more. <laughs> <laughs> so, moral of it all is your insurance rates are going to go up. It's inevitable. Um, right. You kind of have to ride it out for the duration. Uh, be safe. Be smart. Be courteous. <laughs> and uh, maybe in a few years, those rates will go back down if everybody kind of. Uh, takes care out on the roadways. I think he's lying to you, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> They're not going to ever go back down. <laughs> All right, and that's been uh, this week's little tidbit in the insurance zone with Dennis and Justin.